this training is to look at the cost module within Safran Risk. And the reason for the video, because the software has been developed over time over the last several years, uh, little new features and big new features, etc. They're, they're scattered across lots of videos. So the purpose of this is to bring them all into one place um, for the first time. So I'm going to spend a bit of time talking about uh, the cost module and how it is the natural kind of alternative uh, to say using a resource loaded schedule in your risk modeling. Um, I'm not going to get into the pros and cons in this video of the two different methodologies because uh, both are valid. So it's not that there's a right way or a wrong way. So this is specifically just looking at if you choose to use the cost module, which is looking at a CBS cost breakdown structure, then how do you do that? How do you use it? OK, so we're going to have a, a fairly simple, simplified look at that today. So I'm going to be. I'll aim to put um, some files up onto our support portal where you can download some demo files and things like that for yourself. So just log on there to have a look after this video is released. Um, if you want to kind of follow along and have a sort of safe little sand pit to, to play around with. But mostly this is just going to be a kind of show and tell because it touches on so many other parts of the software. I'm going to have to deviate into like the risk register and come back and things. So we're not going to exclusively be in just like the cost screen today. So just to, to warn you. Hi, so thanks very much for watching the first video in this series. Now I've actually spoken to camera for about two hours in this series, but I've broken it down into about 30 separate videos and you've probably seen that already from the, the website. Um, but what I would like to just impress upon you is that if you go through these in sequence, that's absolutely fine. Some people will not want to do that. They're going to want to jump around. So I'll come on at the end of each video and just explain where they might want to go next. Maybe they were looking to find something and they didn't quite find it in the video that they thought they were going to find it in. Because, you know, you cover some basic things to begin with and then advanced stuff later on in the, in the series. So broadly speaking, the first sort of one to seven videos covers your fundamentals. There's about 20 minutes of that. Then the next 45 minutes to an hour, you're looking at the kind of uh, how to introduce your uncertainties, your risk variables uh, and formulas, things like this. And then it's that last sort of 45 minute section where we go into some more advanced topics or alternative methods for doing prolongation, alternative methods for delay penalties, this kind of thing. So I hope you enjoy and of course, do send us your questions. Okay, thanks very much.